Good day, it's 5.25 p.m. February. <clears throat> Let me get the exact date, guys. 19th, 2019. Let's get that out of the way. Let's take a look at Litecoin. It's 47.47. Uh, let's take a look for the manipulation walls. As now we have uh, achieved this... Uh, uh, I guess a sort of breakthrough and understanding of what's going on. The 3011 is embedded in this 4023. So now let's go get a little calculator and show you how these walls and their manipulation are key to of how they're manipulating the price. Now we have to get the bottom wall. Forty-seven, forty-seven. Now, those walls just moved. So we have the prices of the top and the bottom walls. So now you're going to see the 47 spot 52 change to 47.47. We're not we're not off by more than t uh, 10 uh, 10 cents. So. Those walls are used to manipulate the price to, use, use, to manipulate the price in a certain range. Now they move the walls. Let's see now the price is going to start going to 47 spot 47. Now, now you understand what we're talking about. We just hit 47 47. So now, it's so easy to tell now. Exactly. Half a cent off again. I mean, well, what else do we have to tell you guys? And it's actually hovering now at 4747. And it will stay there until they move those walls again. So the formula works. If, you, if the walls move and then you quick rush in and do the calculation... The price will go to where the walls have just been, you know, the medium has dictated to go to. So, I don't know what else to tell these people, but uh, we're being taken. Look, line and sinker. Let's see if the other wall changed. This one's still the same, 46.94. Now we see a difference by a penny. Let's see why. Nah. It's just people playing in the muck, they're, what they're allowed to trade between. So, but, look at this. Matt does not lie. Those two walls have been confirmed by using a simple high school school formula of averages. Prove they're manipulating the price. We're within a half a cent. We watched the wall move. We recalculated it. It was 47.50 something. And we told you it was going down to 47 spot 47 and look exactly where the price is. What else can we tell you? Um, well, I, I think more people need to respond and start using this formula and start checking it yourselves. You find the kettle and walls because they're the same size on both. They're the largest walls on the buy and the sell side. You'll see them. The largest buy wall, the largest sell wall. They'll both be the same size. It might take you a little while to discover them because they'll be mixed in with other trades. But in this case, it's 3011 spot 10. Okay? And usually, it's embedded in the largest wall. It's always the largest wall. It's always embedded in the largest wall. So you see it down here. It's embedded with a little... 
five Litecoin trade. So we know for a fact. So now those walls look like they moved, right? Let's see. 47.10. You, you see the price? 47.10. It moved up. To, this, this wall has moved up. So now the 47 to 46.94 has changed. 47.10 lending to the increase. You see how they're manipulating it? The 40, this wall was at 46.94. They rose it up to 47.10. Now the price is 47.53. That's six cents. If you look at this wall, 47.10, 94. That's three, six cents. Now this wall is 16 cents above. So it's probably going to climb up a little higher. We could do the average and figure it out, but we just showed you in the first movement, we calculated it's going to go to 47.47 and it reached there. So what you have to do to keep track of the price, so if, if you're smart and if you really have a large amount of cash, say you have a large amount of cash, you got $100,000, you can make some money knowing this formula. So now they raised the price of the bottom wall, changing the average median, and now it's 47.53, which is about six cents. So I don't know what else to tell you. These guys are criminals. It's it's too obvious now. It, it, when it's been reduced to a simple formula now. All right, gonna post it. Think we're just gonna have to take these guys to the ringer. They have to learn a lesson that we're not gonna stay in here and get ripped off and not do anything. Uh, next week, I'll fill out the papers for the CFTC. I'll send them out. I already got a reply from the New York uh, uh, State Attorney General. I already uh, am involved in the case with the CFTC as an expert witness. But I also want to be sure that I recover my funds as well from these people. There's no guarantee. Yeah, yeah. You got the, you, you uncovered the crime. You got them locked up. Well, where's my money? Well, we didn't say you were going to get your money. That's exactly what will happen unless they fill out those forms. All right, let me post this, people. Be wary. Watch out. These guys are crooks.